Two children from a Virginia family are recovering in Lexington after being injured in a car accident here last month. Happened late at night, October 19th. ABC 36's Jane Davenport sat down with family friends for an update on the parents and their two young children who continue to receive treatment at UK Children's Hospital. The Bellinger family was traveling from Virginia for a weekend with family here in Lexington when the unthinkable happened. I, I jumped out of bed and I was crying and, you know, he asked me what was wrong. I was like, all I could say was just the kids. Ten-year-old Autumn and eight-year-old Damon were in their parents' car on Kentucky Route 627 when another driver crossed the double yellow line, hitting the family's car head-on. Autumn receiving the worst of the injuries. Shiloh Marker says it's a miracle the accident happened so close to medical care since Autumn suffered life-threatening injuries to her neck and lungs. By the grace of God that this all happened just 10 minutes from the children's hospital where they've been these last few weeks. Meanwhile, Damon had to have both his spleen and a kidney removed, and... He had very badly bruised lungs. Autumn and Damon's parents, Amber Anna and Jacob, both dealing with their own injuries while taking care of their kids in the hospital. The mother and the father, like that, that instinct, it's like, you know, you just push through and do whatever you can for your kids. Right now, Autumn still has a long way to go in terms of recovery. They just currently put in a stomach tube for her because she can't pass the swallow test. So the she can't yeah. swallow water. As for Damon. Damon is doing well. Um, we're seeing his personality come out more, which is such a relief. The Virginia family will have to stay here in Lexington for the time being. Both parents stop working and are staying with their kids at the hospital full time. Can't ever prepare for anything like this either, so... Yeah. They definitely need all the help that they can get. In Lexington, Jane Davenport, ABC 36 News Now.